The Hamas spokesman in Gaza said on Wednesday that his Islamic movement praised what he called a courageous operation in Jerusalem, in which a Palestinian rammed his car into pedestrians in central Jerusalem, killing one person before he was shot dead by police. It was the second attack of its kind in two weeks, fueling concerns of a burgeoning Palestinian uprising. An Israeli security official identified the driver as Ibrahim Akari from East Jerusalem, and Hamas claimed responsibility for what it termed a heroic running over operation. The road rampage was the second in two weeks in Jerusalem, and the scene was again a stop along its light railway, which links Arab and Jewish areas in what Israel has portrayed as a symbol of unity in its contested capital. Police and witnesses said the driver deliberately slammed his white van into three paramilitary border policemen, crossing a street straddling a Palestinian neighborhood and an ultra-Orthodox Jewish area, and then into people at the railway stop. Crashing to a halt at a nearby junction, he emerged from the van and began striking at pedestrians with a metal pipe. Palestinians accusing Israel of trying to change the delicate status quo at the compound that houses Al-Aqsa Mosque and the Dome of the Rock Shrine have been mounting daily stone-throwing protests at the site, whose religious administration is overseen by Jordan. Hours before the road attack, Israeli security forces hurling stun grenades clashed with Palestinian stone throwers at Alaska Mosque, a confrontation that has played out frequently over the past several weeks.